Hey guys, this is Rudolf Thurmer. And, um, uh, um, I, I just wanted to share with you uh, about a topic. <laughs> okay, okay, mom! Okay, sorry, 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 my mom was just telling me to eat my dinner. Uh, um, I want to tell you about a topic I'm so excited about. Um, I, I, I don't have Black Ops 2 yet, but, um, oh, oh, knife that bitch. Oh, I didn't knife you. Anyway, um, I, I want to pre-order Black Ops 3. Like, I'm just so pumped because Black Ops 1 was just, like, the best shooter ever. And, like, you can see that I know, I have my skills down. Like, look at the graphics right here. And, like, look at the way he's just moving the gun. Like, I can't imagine how you do that in Black Ops 3. Like, like the entire camera can move. Oh, look at that. No scope. Oh, I picked up that AUG. Well, in Black Ops 3, I hope they go back to the Black Ops 1 era. And, and they should bring back Jungle. And, um, they need to bring back the, the, uh... Sorry, I didn't take my meds today. Um, they need to take back the, the AUG. Oh, look at that guy. He just shot. Oh, I don't know why I threw the grenade. <laughs> I, I wasted the grenade. <laughs> okay, guys. I, I, oh, oh, look at that kid. Oh, right there. And the, oh, I got him. I got him good. This is just so action-packed. And um, in Black Ops 3, when I pre-order it, there better be like Nuke Town again. Because I love Nuketown. Apparently they pulled that from Black Ops 2. But I, I know they're just going to pull it out and put it in Black Ops 3. Because like eventually they're going to have to make a good game, right? So, um, yeah, this game's the best. And um, as you can see, there's this guy bitching about how he sucks. Because he's not a level 47 prestige like me. But, yeah, that's something else that you do in Black Ops 3. There should, like, you should automatically prestige, if you know what I'm saying. Automatic prestiging is just like so essential to to the awesomeness of, of Black Ops 3 and uh, maybe even Modern Warfare 4. Like I'm totally totally gonna buy uh, Black Ops 4. I mean Modern Warfare 4, but Black Ops 4. We'll get to that after uh, Black Ops 2 is um, is getting stale. Then we can talk about possibilities for Black Ops 4. But in uh, in Black Ops 3. Uh, it needs to be on the Xbox, um, uh, uh, sorry, I didn't do too well in math, like, I fucking failed high school, <laughs> uh, anyway, um, yeah, Xbox 720 and P PS4, PS4, as I like to call it, um, uh, we all know PC is the best, um, I'm just kidding, why would I say that? Xbox is the best. Like, on PC, I can't be as accurate, um, because I don't have a controller, but, uh, in Black Ops 3, they should only allow controllers, just like the Xbox. So, on PC, I can pwn like I do on Xbox. Like, right now, I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm trying to use a mouse. There's a guy right there. There's oh my god. Well, I don't know what I'm doing, and Black Ops 3 can fix that. Um, I, I want to see uh, Death Streaks return because it really helps out bad players like me. And um, I want to see the support class from Modern Warfare 3 because um, uh, um, alright, one sec. Let me take my meds, okay? One, one minute, one minute. Alright, all right, I'm better. In, um, in about half an hour, I'll, I'll be pumped, I'll be good. And um, this is a preliminary video. Uh, I'll make a Black Ops 3 wish list right now, actually. For, for Blops 3, I want there to be... Um, I want there to be the jungle map. And... Oh, Napalm Strike should come back. And, like, it should take place in the 90s. Because, I mean, the 90s is the best. Like, that's when Spongebob first came out. And Hey Arnold and everything like that. So, like, maybe if there were characters in the storyline in the 90s. Like, during the Persian War of the Gulf. You know, that war. 
where uh, America just pwned everybody. But, um, yeah, that's actually every war, so sorry for not being very specific, but, yeah. We should basically have a game like that in, in the Persian Gulf War, and we, we kill some Iraqis, just like um, we do now. Oh, wait, no. No, that war ended. I'm, I'm so I can't keep track of all these wars. I apologize, guys. Anywhere, care package right there. Care packages should be back in Black Ops 3. Um, uh, I really like the jungle map. It reminds me of the time I spent in the jungle. And RCXDs need to be back too. So do AK-47s because in the 90s I knew AK-47s are like, are like, the, they're like. The rage, yeah, the rage, and um, but the AK-47 should suck because the Iraqis use them, and we all know Iraqistan's a terrible country. So, um, uh, Sad Sada Saddam Obama Hussein, oh wait, no, Saddam Hussein, yeah, that guy, um. He should be a character too. Like I don't know, Hey Arnold um, should should like kill Saddam Hussein because he with, he looks like a football head, kind of like Stewie Griffin, except Stewie's evil and Hey Arnold is kind of gay. I don't know if he's wearing a skirt or something, but I I'm, I'm just not sure. He looks like he's wearing a skirt and uh, oh the movie the, the game can be about gay rights. Gay rights in Black Ops would be the best. Like, instead of the future is black, it could have been, like, the past is gay. And, um, that would, that would, uh, make kids want to learn about history. Because, um, all kids love Black Ops 3. Because it's the best. And, and I haven't even got to zombies yet. So, um, let me see how much time is left. Oh, no. Anyway, there should be zombies again. Except it should be survival mode for Modern Warfare 3. Because Modern Warfare 3 is the best. And I love saying Modern Warfare 3, Modern Warfare 3. Warfare of the Modern Wars, and, um, anyway, uh, look, a li um, like, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos on Black Ops. Oh, sorry, that's just my meds kicking in.